YouTubers, this is Champion DJK coming at you again with another Hot Wheels video. And today I'm going to show you a few customs that I've been working on. And uh, we're going to start off with this sweet super van here. Um, this one, as you can see, I put in working LED lights. This was my entry into the Friday Night Lakes custom, uh, May custom van build competition. Um, hosted by uh, the CEO, Mr. Sensitivity. Uh, but anyway, this is the, the custom that I entered into the competition. Um, it did not win. I got like seventh place. Uh, didn't do as well as I thought it would do, but I had a super fun time building this and a real fun time adding these uh, LED headlights to the, to the vehicle. Um, so anyway, I uh, just wanted to show you this for a little bit. We'll go through a couple other customs that I've been working on. Um, by the way, if you're a customizer and you're not on Instagram, um, you're definitely missing out. There is a lot of cool stuff on there. Um, just a, a lot of neat uh, sharing of customs and custom ideas and all sorts of things on Instagram. A lot more than there is on YouTube. So if you're, you're customizing Hot Wheels, um, you should definitely get on Instagram and, and join the fun on there. Um, anyway, so here's this. So as you can see, working LED lights. I, this is the first time I tried using a decal. Um, I actually printed this on a computer and uh, cut it out and put it on. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty clean. Um, did some detail on the front. Uh, just painted a little license plate on the back. If you flip this over here, there's the switch in the bottom to shut on and off the lights. So there they are off. Pretty sweet. And uh, turn it back on. And there they are on. So, pretty sweet. I was really happy that I was able to pull this off and uh, put this together. I will probably post a separate video um, just for this van, just showing you how the, the lights are wired up, uh, what battery I used and whatnot, in case anybody else wants to try to do this. Um, but anyway, there's the uh, custom van. Um, other finished works, I finished the Toyota Tundra. Um, this I did for my Hot Wheels buddy, in-town buddy Chuck, that's hooked me up with lots of cool cars in the past. I'm actually, he's coming over today. I'm going to be giving this to him. Um, anyway, pretty sweet. Did a little detail on the front. Did a little uh, tail light detail on the back. Uh, the wheels are actually from a Matchbox armored truck. Um, had to make my own axles for this one. Still, it rolls pretty good. It's got a little bit of suspension to it, too. Um, anyway, pretty neat. Happy to be done with that one. Uh, next up, we got uh, Lotus Europa, which I finished this week. Uh, painted it in this cool color green, like this fluorescent green, did some detailing. Um, I obviously didn't paint that license plate, <laughs> that was already on there. Um, anyway, this thing used to be brown, it had a brown base, I painted that black, painted the other stuff green, I think it looks pretty sweet, painted uh, silver around the windows, a little window trim. Um, anyway, I'm pretty happy with the way this one turned out, didn't put any rubber tires on it, left the originals on it, because I had nothing else that would have looked better. And uh, I think the original, actually, Matchbox did a great job with the, with the wheels on this one. Uh, so there's that. And then we got, this one's kind of a work in progress, not quite finished yet. Don't know what other detail I want to add to this one. Really love the, the purple paint job. Oh, and I realized that the lights are incorrect. Uh, these should not be red. Those should be, like, the backup lights. And the corner should be the red tail lights. So I'll repaint those. And redo that. This is also the original wheels that were on this vehicle. I didn't do any swapping there. Just did the purple paint job. Which, by the way, this is a Dupacolor metal cast paint. It's uh, pretty sweet. I got it in almost every color they have available. Um, I don't know. Pretty easy to use. I've had really good results with it. So, And I've had a lot of good comments about this purple car. So I just thought I'd share the, the paint details for you. Or with you. All right, so there's that one. And uh, then we got some uh, work, works in progress. I got this gasser. This one <clears throat> I cut the roof off of. And this still, I have a lot of work to do on this one yet. Made axles for it, but it does not sit right at all. It rolls, but it's totally crooked. So I got to fix that. Um, so that'll take a, take a little bit of work. Did some detailing on the body. Um, did some silver on the trim. Painted the interior black and left the engine chrome. It's all part of the same piece. Painted the exhaust tips. Anyway, it's screwed together. It rolls. I just need to definitely do some work on that one. Um, other works in progress we got. This van's not screwed back together yet, but I will be putting LED lights in this one. 
So this will be another one that will light up. Pretty sweet. Not quite ready to do tail, yet, tail lights as well yet, but this one will get headlights. Uh, and then we've got this Porsche 959. This one's almost done. Detailed it yesterday. Um, I'm going to polish up the, the plastic bit a little bit so it's not as cloudy. So you can see the interior. Not sure I'm a huge fan of the wheels on it, but I think it looks all right. Now that I screwed it together, paint some detail on the back, and there's that one. Then we got this Ferrari. This one is pretty sweet. Needs detailing. Haven't detailed it at all, but this thing was just a trashed old mainline. And uh, I did a really good job, I think, uh, getting the plastic to clear up because it was like super cloudy. Um, but anyway, here's the Ferrari. Pretty sweet. It's got to paint some detail on there, re clear coat it, and this one will be done. And then, last, I got this sweet old flat out 442, which this thing is sweet. This is just a cool casting. Um, this casting was totally destroyed. Um, I still need to add detail to this one, just picked out the wheels for it. Um, I really think it's cool. I did that uh, orange to yellow kind of metal cast fade on this paint job just like I did for uh, the van. So pretty cool. Um, and that's pretty much it. So there's the customs that I've been working on. I've been fortunate enough to have the last like week off of work because um, I was on vacation and didn't really have much uh, to do. So I did a lot of Hot Wheels customizing. And uh, there's some works in progress for you. Some uh, stuff that's finished. And uh, I'm having a lot of fun working on these cars. So um, thanks again to um, actually Mr. Sensitivity for kind of inspiring me to get involved in the Friday Night Likes contest. I thought that was really neat. Um, I think it's a really cool thing. So any of you customizers out there, I definitely encourage you to participate. It is a blast. Um, it was really fun Friday just seeing people vote on cars and stuff like that and, and to see everybody else's work. There were so many amazing uh, customs. They all looked pretty awesome. So anyway, that is going to be it for today. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, have a great day. And uh, thanks for subscribing. Uh, please check me out at Instagram, championdjk underscore Hot Wheels, if you want to see more customs and more works in progress. And uh, thank you very much. Have a good day.